Now to the coronavirus pandemic. A dramatic plea from a woman who is pregnant urging others to get vaccinated if they are pregnant or thinking of becoming pregnant. And she says it could save a life and has become a nationwide concern as cases rise. CBS Source Peter Dench is live outside Broward Health in Fort Lauderdale with her story. Peter. Well, Keith and Maryville nationwide health experts have seen a dramatic increase in the number of pregnant women with COVID-19 in the past several weeks. There are a couple of factors here that are very important. The highly transmissible Delta variant and the low vaccination rate for women who are pregnant. And we just heard from a number of doctors and that woman about the need to get vaccinated. I'm 37 weeks pregnant now. I've done all the testing. I've done multiple ultrasounds. The baby's good. He's great. So I would recommend that pregnant moms get the vaccine. It's not, it's not going to affect you or your baby. You should get it. You should get protected. Lucia Pisano Urbina says that can save a life. You want to be there for your baby. You're, the doctors now just spoke about cases. You can't see if you have COVID and you go into the hospital, you have your baby, you won't be able to see your baby even immediately after having him. So you should get the vaccine. Pisano Urbina showed us a photo of her getting vaccinated. I just wanted to be protected from from the from the um, virus. Really, um, I was worried, obviously, but I talked to my doctor and he told me absolutely you should get the second shot. Health experts in the CDC urge all maternity patients to get vaccinated to help prevent miscarriages, preterm deliveries, and other significant problems. Doctors say the vaccine is safe and effective, and they are discouraged by the latest figures. We know that for a number of reasons, pregnant women have not taken the vaccine. In fact, when you look across the data, only about one in four pregnant women have been vaccinated for COVID-19. We have never seen anything like this before. Now we're dealing with young people and especially pregnant young women, and that is devastating. We have seen many, unfortunately, many pregnant women so far in our critical care units, and we've been dealing with it. Some of them are unfortunately not fortunate enough to leave the hospital. And the worst part is they deteriorate right after they have the baby and not able to hold that baby and not able to see that baby for days and weeks. It's really unfortunate and this is preventable. Now, doctors say the vaccines do not cause more miscarriages and infertility. Zano Urbina, meanwhile, who is a Broward Health employee, is expecting her second child, and she hopes that others will listen to her message. We're live in Fort Lauderdale. Peter Dench, CBS 4 News.